guys, welcome back to the channel. So before we get into this, I'm gonna put the comment of the day up and if you guys wanna take part in it, all you have to do is leave a comment and I randomly choose them for my new notifications. Before we get into it again, also I have a cold, so I'm a little bit stuffy, I apologize. I am hopefully not going to be sniffling too freaking much, but I've been sneezing all day and it is just like, I've had enough. I have had enough. Uh, so we are just going to get into this. We're playing some late night today. I really wanted to play this family and guess who has not left the house yet? Like not at all. Not at all. They're having a little bit of romance right now. They're embracing each other and Piper does go to work today, but we're gonna, we're gonna risky woohoo before we go to work because I mean, why would we not? She wants to woohoo with him. So there we go. There we go. That works out really, really well. And we have you getting ready uh, in this nasty, very, very nasty shower. It is also a snow day today, so the kiddos don't have to do anything, and I'm sure they are loving that, but I will probably make them, like, you know, go out somewhere and just kind of have some fun, a little bit of fun, maybe go to the festival together. We'll see what we can do. I honestly totally forgot about Randall, so we better feed him before he dies. Um, but I do want to eventually move into a house because like I am so ready to have a home but I also really do love this apartment because I did spend a lot of time kind of putting this thing together or decorating it so it will be sad when we leave but I am kind of ready for a bigger space and for her to you know I want her to have what she wants and I'm hoping we'll get there. You know, she's working pretty hard. We're going to be going to work today and we won't be getting a promotion because we just got one, but you know, we can work pretty hard. I could always get her the, what is it? The entrepreneurship, uh, there is a card for romance. Yeah. I don't know why that always pops up, but we could get her that entrepreneur, entrepreneurship lifetime reward and she'll get kind of promoted a little quicker, but I just kind of want her to, you know, do her thing. Now she wants to break up with him, girl. No, we're not going to break up with him right now. Okay. We're kind of, we're kind of enjoying him right now. She has commitment issues, doesn't she? She does. So I'm, I'm not going to lock that in because I, I kind of like him for her. I think that they kind of mesh well. Uh, girl, let's get you going because you have to go to work. But I do. I think that he's a pretty decent person. He is, um, inappropriate loner and athletic. And I don't know what the other traits are, but I mean, he's been here this whole time. He has stayed with the kids. You know, it's just, it's just very, very sweet how, how he is with the family. Okay. Did you, you got yourself all taken care of. The bathroom is so freaking disgusting. It is unbelievable. Let's see. Reinforcement. Go ahead and praise for being non-destructive. Oh, you were coming over here to do something, but we're going to have her praise turtle for being non-destructive because we love this little man so freaking much. Like he is the reason we have what He's we very, have very him. slowly making her way outside. Uh, it's so weird seeing her be a vampire. Okay, game. Can we get it together? It's so weird seeing her be a vampire, but it is so fitting for her. We're going to go ahead and have her grab the mail. Um, but yeah, I think that Piper is absolutely perfect for being a vampire. She fits it so well. I mean, look at her. She is freaking beautiful. I keep forgetting to turn on the aging for the vampires or for the occults and stuff, or I don't know if they're all like that, but I always forget how to do it. So I'll figure it out. I'll figure out how to turn the aging on because I do want her to age, but I always just like, just don't remember. And I just totally forget until I'm like, oh yeah, forgot to do that. <laughs> <laughs> so let's see what we got in the mail. If we got anything too exciting, probably nothing. Oh my God. She just got stuck in the elevator. Poor girl. She's, she's so cute. I love her. Oh my gosh. Okay. Can we, can we do this? Uh, oh my God. Jessica Talon, formerly Jessica Talon is Jessica Gleason. Uh, and they have a, you know, they're looking for, you know, a little, a little home and they're not getting it. Um, but yeah, that's kind of interesting. So let's see here. Raymond Castello Castellonos. Okay. Keep an open mind for a sec while I paint you a picture. You, me, together. How does that make you feel? Pretty fucking disgusting, actually. Okay. Very tender love. I've been dreaming of you and me getting together. Will you make my dreams come true? Absolutely not. And Rhett Bigelow. I know this is coming out of nowhere, but I think you should take a chance on me. I'm a lot of fun and I think we'd be great together. I absolutely do not think that. Um, we're going to go to the festival. We're going to have Riley go and then we're going to have... You go. We're going to take 
Turtle with us because I want Turtle to be able to spend the last bit of his life because you guys, he is literally, <laughs> I don't want to even say it, but any day now and I am not, not okay because Turtle has been such an amazing gift to this family and you know we're gonna take him with us and make sure that he spends his last days or whatever the case may be with us doing everything that we possibly can so maybe we can play fetch out there and just have a good time because i mean he deserves it he really he does deserve the everybody world. is finally showing up i kind of want them to take a greeting card photo just like all of them together kind of take a little greeting card photo he's just about arriving so no we're not gonna read we're gonna have you guys take a cute little sibling photo i just find it so cute when they do that so let's go over here and can we take a photo with the dog i don't think that we can we're gonna go ahead and take a photo with our sisters and kind of you know see what happens there see what this turns out like it's probably going to be dang adorable i just love taking these every single time we get here it's just my favorite thing okay girl oh we got invited to diana jones party which is at 908 we might go ahead and go to that because you know why the heck not so let's see what this photo is going to look like how cute is it oh my gosh it's so cute riley is the only one not in her outerwear i did not mean to click on that riley is the only one not in her outerwear which is adorable uh, come over here and make a snow angel you also want to make a snow angel so go ahead and make one and what are you doing you want to make a snowman for sure come over here and make a snowman we're just gonna have them kind of do their thing and let's see the usual caterer couldn't make it today so the studio hired a replacement unfortunately for everyone the food wasn't fresh and piper isn't feeling well that is just lovely so turtle is running around like a little crazy man which is so cute and we're going to have him when he's done where are you? Are you done? Oh my god, hold on, I gotta get a picture of this. This was gonna be so cute. Oh no, she got up. Oh man, that was gonna be so cute. Maybe it maybe it's not gonna be so cute because he looks like he's just done with life. <laughs> like, okay, like he's just like, you know what? I just don't want to be part of this any longer. But we're gonna let him maybe go play uh fetch with Turtle. Why don't we have you? why don't we have you come over here and snowboard and you're still building your snowman and then when you're done you can come over here and skate turtle where did you go okay you're over here so let's come over here to turtle and no we want to talk to turtle and we're gonna go ahead and play oh we can't do um fetch so we'll do a tug of war is she still building her snowman like girl you're taking a long time oh my god look at this. look at your look at your look at your damn noggin uh, you're you look like a plant sim and you're She made her me. snowman. I don't exactly know what it is that we made, but we did do something here and I'm not sure. Let's see. What is it going to be? It's just a classic snowman. So nothing fancy fancy, but still. Okay. We played tug of war and I totally missed it. So I'm going to have him. Oh wait, are they playing chase? They're playing chase. Oh, I'm going to let him play chase. This is so freaking cute. He's going to be enjoying this so much because he's with the kiddos and he's probably just having the time of his life. This is so... You guys, I nearly had a heart attack because it says nauseous and I'm like, oh my god. But it's from work with that gross food. So we are, we are good, but I nearly, I nearly lost it because I'm like, there's no way. There's no freaking way. Um, what does she want to do? Five snor snowboard tricks. How many are you doing, girl? You must be doing pretty good over here. She does have to use the bathroom, but let's see. How many tricks have we done? Two tricks. Girl, okay, get it. She's doing good. I would be face down. Oh, my God. Oh, that, yeah, that would have been me. She did three out of five, which is pretty, pretty good. Are you tired, bubs? No, what are you going to do? You're going to, oh, you're going to jump onto. I don't really want you to jump onto anything, um, but you probably should get home with the kids before it gets too, too late. And Mama Bear will be, like, a little stressed out that they are not home. So I'm going to send them home and let them warm up. So everyone is heading home. She just got home, and we're going to have her come over here and grab some plasma juice before, you know, the party that we were invited to. She does need to dance, but I wanted to go to this party and see if we can meet some more Sims because, you know, we need to get a little more celebrity. We are a level... Wait a minute. No, 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 this is not <laughs> Oh my god, why is this happening to me? Okay, so I was pretty upset earlier because I thought she was pregnant and she was sick from work, but, um, 
You guys, this time she's actually freaking pregnant with William Fangman's baby and I'm literally gonna die. Like, did that really just happen? Okay, so <laughs> now what do we do? We're getting the call and I'm assuming it is for the party that Diana Jones invited us to. Uh, so we're gonna go to that and we're going to really think about what has just happened because I was not expecting that. And it happened, so yeah, that's just great. That is just great. And he's choking because he well, can't. We even just arrived it. and we are about ready to immediately go upstairs and barf in this woman's um, you know very nice apartment so that's a little embarrassing but you know it is what it is it happens you know is the party over is there literally nobody here like am i am i confused am i lost here where where are all of the sims everybody's down here is everybody leaving is the party that lame apparently it is but here's mr matthew hamming um everybody's leaving already literally the lamest party it looks like everybody is so disappointed well i guess we're just gonna go upstairs barf in her in her toilet and then leave like okay that's what you get for having a lame party so it animal. is morning and they're just kind of getting themselves together and i don't know where you went but you're coming over here to sniff i want the kiddos because they all really want to become good friends or chat with mom and he wants to become friends with her I almost want to do like a mother, look at, he wants to talk to Piper. I almost want to do like a mother, daughter, or mother, son day, but I kind of want to just have a family day where they go out together and maybe kind of bond a little bit. So let me see if there's any movies or anything. Uh, next show at 12 p.m. So maybe we can all go to the movies together or a concert or a game or something because I just really want them to kind of you know, do their thing. So let's see here. I hope that there will actually be a game or I mean, um, a movie at noon because that would be really, really great for them. Otherwise, maybe we can go grab some food, even though they're not hungry, but we just want to bond and, you know, maybe we can even tour the theater and just go around town and do something. So this is her little pregnancy outfit. She wants to have a girl, which is kind of funny. We have two other girls, but I mean, we have pretty much, you know, everything we need, but she wants to have another girl. So poor little Axel might be, might be uh, outnumbered if she gets her wish. So I'm going to go ahead and lock that in and see um, what we get. So leave me some baby names down below because, oh girl, we're going to need them. And obviously this is going to be a vampire baby, which is kind of interesting. We'll have our one little, one little special kiddo here and you know, it'll be kind of interesting. So let's go to the movie. Let's see if the movie is actually playing. It's kind of late now because she had to go through all that. So, oh, we can attend movie, attend movie. Let's see. What should we go see? They came with tweezers. Let's go to explosions, bigger, better, and louder with our kids. Hello, our kids. We have Lyric, Riley. Oh, William's there? Well, can Turtle can go? Oh my God, we're taking Turtle with us. And William, where's so Axel went in without everybody else? I guess he's gonna watch the movie on his own. He got half price, so nothing wrong with that. We're actually waiting for Turtle to come see the movie with us. And I'm literally going to scream if he can go see the Turtle movie. Turtle has arrived. He's actually gonna go attend the movie. I've never had a pet attend the movie, but I've also never tried to have a pet attend the movie with us. I am pretty dang excited and this will be turtles very first movie oh my god axel was the first one out obviously because he went in to see the movie without everybody else he literally didn't care uh but he saw a great action movie so that is really really good he's going home he literally does not care about any of us actually i want you to wait because i'm probably gonna have you guys go have some dinner or something or some lunch or with some dinner. It's it's late. Uh, we did get a party invitation at 8.59. We're going to go ahead and say I'll be there. I don't know if I will, but he wants to hang out with a mom and talk to her, but then he totally left everybody in the dust. He was like, I'm going to see this movie. I have no time for anybody else. Who are you? We're not taking a cell phone So photo. Mama Bear is coming out. Our sister's coming out. Okay, so all we have to do, let's go ahead and chat with our son because he does want to like have a moment with us oh my god you actually saw i'm literally screaming that you got to see a freaking movie i had no 
Oh my god, I thought she passed out. I had no idea that pets could go with you to go see a movie, but this has just changed my entire life. We need to give you a treat because you are a little bit, a little bit hungry, I will say that. So maybe we can, um, wait, what is this? Hold on, hold on, hold on. The caring scientists at the science facility cannot help you with your project if you don't attend their information tour. It's a good idea to show up to you. <gasps> Did we miss something? Oh my god, I think we must have missed something and I didn't even notice. <gasps> Whoops, that is absolutely not good. Oh, Axel, maybe we need to have just like a mother-son a mother-son time. She saw a terrible action movie. He had a good time. He wants to be our friend, but I feel like maybe he's a little a little jealous that he's, you know, not going to be the baby anymore. I'm going to have her uh, disband or quit the group to maybe spend some time with him and we'll let the girls kind of do their thing and maybe we'll send turtle home because he is feeling a little he's feeling a little rough because he needs to get some food so maybe i'll have the girls go somewhere where could we have them go um i don't want them to get into too much trouble but is there a concert <gasps> there we go attend a concert that will be perfect and then mother son can have a little bit of time together they can go out to eat they can spend you know a little bit of quality time because i feel like he is maybe a little jealous and their friendship isn't that great so I kind of want to, you know, make this, make this, uh, my dad likes to fart. Uh, your dad likes to do a lot of things that is really inappropriate, but whatever. Um, but we're going to just kind of see if we can spend some time. Did you know that William Fengman is filthy rich? I would have never guessed. Oh, bitch. Is that why we're, is that why we're doing this? Is that why we're doing this? Because honestly, okay, where the hell did he go anyway? Because I kind of want to, I kind of want to know. Of course, Jessica Gleason and Brand Gleason cannot find a home to move into, which is pretty dang funny if you ask me. All right, let me see. Let's give him, can we just give him a compliment? And let's go grab some dinner with our son. We're going to go to the fancy place, the fancy restaurant and eat with our son. And we're just gonna have a nice little mother-son date and it'll be really adorable. And hopefully they'll have a good, have a good time and he'll enjoy it because, you know, I want him to hang out with his mama. Look at her, pregnant mama looking so good. I can't even deal. He doesn't even wanna look, he's so nervous. Yeah, boy, I know you are. Okay, look at his little outfit. Oh my God, why is he so cute? I don't even know. He's just the cutest thing. He's flattered. He's flattered from the compliment that his mother gave. Okay, are they doing their thing? I guess they saw the concert. Saw a great concert. Did they both have a good time? They did. That's perfect. So I guess we'll just kind of let them do their thing. Let's see, where do you guys want to go? I don't want to send you obviously to a bar or anything because that would be a little bit, a little bit weird. Um, is there anything we can do here? Maybe they can pull a prank together. We're gonna have them pull a prank together. Let's go release frogs from the science class. Uh, oh, we can't do it together. Okay, I don't wanna, I don't wanna go alone. They're both hungry. Come over here to Flying V's. How about that? Eat here with your group. Have a good time and so we're know. not gonna go to the party we were invited to because we really just wanna spend some time with Axel and, uh, you know, just, you know, make his night because he just, he really is just wanting to have mom's attention and have, you know, that relationship with her. So we're going to try our best to make that happen for him. He does want to be friends with her. Piper, or Piper, I was like, Piper, Turtle, are you, are you okay? Because you need to, you need to make sure that you're taking care of yourself too. We'll, we'll get you a toy and get you kind of going here, make sure you're good and I'll let you go to sleep and come back over here. So I think it's funny that the only person who did not like the movie was her. She's the only one that did not enjoy it. Let's make a silly face. What are you doing? Oh, you're playing tag. Okay, this could help their friendship a little bit, playing tag. I think that's so adorable. So they're just kind of having a good time. They were playing, uh, they were playing tag. We're gonna just kind of be funny and maybe feel tummy. And let's see what else we'll do. A shaka bra. The girls need to come home because it is getting late and their curfew is about to happen. And he's with her, so we'll just have them come home and, you know, kind of kind of end their night. So we're gonna have them go home together because I don't want him to 
get in trouble when, you know, his mother is right there, but we're going to make sure that we can make that happen. But I'm going to go ahead and get ready to wrap up this right here. In the next part, we are going to uh, maybe possibly have the baby. Not quite sure. It depends on how much I play off camera. I love how he's thinking about Miss Riley. Oh my gosh. And not, not, not happy about babies. Um, I hate to tell you, little guy, I'm so sorry, but <laughs> there's going to be a screaming baby in this house. And I'm going to have to figure out where we're going to put said baby because we just we just don't have a lot of space here i mean it's a big apartment but it is just you know not ideal <laughs> it is not ideal for what we got going on we're gonna go ahead and ask to leave group no we're gonna just can we just disband the group can we not do that? Apparently we can't because I'm clicking on the wrong sim. We're going to disband the group and girl, you need to use the bathroom and just like kind of get yourself to bed. You also need to get yourself to bed. And when you get home, you're going to bed. Everybody is going to bed. Oh my gosh. P Piper Croft is truly amazing. Starting from a complete unknown, Piper Croft has managed to become an appreciated and respected member in the community. Strive to work harder, Piper. You are almost there. You are a renowned VIP. So we are a level four celebrity, which is so exciting. And I'm pretty dang happy for her. So anyways, I am going to wrap up this part right here. Let me know what you guys see in the comments down below. Don't forget to leave me those baby names down below. We're going to have a vampire baby more than likely because they're both vampires. So I can't imagine that we would have a human baby, but I'm excited. Let me know what you guys think about that one. Uh, and you know, don't forget to subscribe, turn on your post notifications, all that fun stuff. I love you all and I'll see you in the next video.